Hello friends, so here is another question on projectile motion with angular projection. So here it is given that a projectile has a range of 50 meters and reaches a maximum height of 10 meters. Calculate the angle at which the projectile is fired. Okay, so let us try to you know, draw the diagram. So it is given that a projectile is fired okay, with a certain initial velocity which is not mentioned and with a certain angle with respect to the horizontal that is also not given. So what is given is this will be the trajectory of the projectile with angular projection and it reaches here okay so this is the ground level <coughs> so let's say this is O this is point P and this is point Q okay so here what is given is that this projectile it has a horizontal range of 50 meters this OQ horizontal displacement that and a maximum height that is from here to here H max that is equal to 10 meters so using these two data we have to determine the angle with which this angle theta with which the projectile was fired. So here first the formula of maximum height. So here the formula is very important. Okay. For this type of question you have to remember the formula. So H max which is given by we know u square sin square theta by 2g. Okay, <clears throat> this is the formula of H max and horizontal range that formula is equal to u square sin 2 theta by g. Okay, u square sin 2 theta by g. So, if we write this in this way h max by r the ratio of maximum height to horizontal range that will be equal to u square sin square theta by 2g divided by u square sin 2 theta by g okay so again <clears throat> we can write it as u square sin theta into sin theta by 2g into g by u square into 2 sin theta into cos theta because sin 2 theta is equal to 2 sin theta into cos theta. So here u square u square gets cancelled okay g g gets cancelled sin theta sin theta gets cancelled so we have 1 by 4 sin theta by cos theta or this is equal to h max by r is equal to one by four tan theta so always remember this important relationship also which we have arrived here the ratio of maximum height to horizontal range that is equal to one by four tan theta so that implies tan theta is equal to four h max that is max four times maximum height divided by the horizontal range so here it is given 
that the maximum height is equal to 10 horizontal range is equal to 50 so here we will write it as 4 into 10 by 50 to 4 by 5 which is equal to 0 0.8 <clears throat> so that implies theta is equal to tan inverse of 0 0.8 so it is coming around 38.659 so 38.66 degrees 66 degrees this is the angle with respect to the horizontal with which the projectile was fired initially okay so here in this case it's good if you you know if if you have the formula with you you know if you remember the formula otherwise you would have to again do the component analysis you know uh, you have to derive the formula you will get that and then you will apply it put this put, you know do all these things so it will add more five or six minutes so three to four minutes to uh, to the duration if you have the formula ready with so again always have the formula ready with you and in case it does not you know you are not able to recall it and you don't want to miss out on the question you can do the component analysis okay so this is the uh, solution and again an important thing always you know recall this thing which we have derived here which we have arrived here the ratio of the maximum height to horizontal range is equal to 1 by 4 tan theta this will also come in handy okay if you have this relationship also ready with you a kind of formula okay so here is another question on projectile motion with angular projection it is given that to prove that the maximum horizontal range is four times the maximum height attained by the projectile when the projectile is fired at an inclination angle so as to have maximum horizontal range okay let us break it down let us try to understand the question through the diagram so it is given that a projectile is fired at an angle okay with respect to the horizontal theta such that it has maximum horizontal range so here if you remember the formula for horizontal range is equal to u square sin 2 theta by g so when the sin 2 theta value will be maximum the range will be maximum what is the maximum value of any sign you know 1 so what is 1 sin 90 degree so when this 2 theta will be equal to 90 degree then the projectile will have maximum horizontal range 2 theta 90 degree that implies theta should be 45 degree so when theta is equal to 45 degree when a projectile is fired at an angle of 45 degree with respect to the horizontal it has maximum horizontal range okay that now here this is equal to u square sin 2 theta by g so when theta is equal to 45 degree r max becomes u square sin 90 degree by g which is equal to u square by g this is the maximum horizontal range of a projectile and it is achievable only when theta is equal to 45 degree the firing angle with respect to the horizontal that is equal to 45 degree now when theta is equal to 45 degree what will be the maximum height for such an angle again the formula of maximum height h max is equal to u square 
साइन स्क्वायर थीटा बाय टू जी विच इज इक्वल टू यू स्क्वायर साइन फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री स्क्वायर बाय टू जी साइन फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री इज इक्वल टू वन बाय रूट टू सो इट इज यू स्क्वायर वन बाय रूट टू स्क्वायर बाय टू जी विच इज इक्वल टू यू स्क्वायर इंटू वन बाय टू बाय टू जी इज इक्वल टू यू स्क्वायर बाय फोर जी और वी कैन राइट इट एज वन बाय फोर इंटू यू स्क्वायर बाय जी वी कैन राइट इट इन दिस वे सो एच मैक्स एच मैक्स इज इक्वल टू वन बाय फोर इंटू यू स्क्वायर बाय जी वॉट इज यू स्क्वायर बाय जी आर मैक्स सो एच मैक्स इज इक्वल टू वन बाय फोर आर मैक्स द मैक्सिमम हॉरिजोंटल रेंज दैट इम्प्लाइज आर मैक्स मैक्सिमम हॉरिजोंटल रेंज इज इक्वल टू फोर टाइम्स द मैक्सिमम हाइट विच वॉज आस्ट to prove in the question that the maximum horizontal range is four times the maximum height attained by the projectile when fired at an inclination angle so as to have maximum horizontal range so the meaning of this line is when fired at an angle so as to have maximum horizontal range means the projectile should be fired at an angle of 45 degree with respect to the horizontal when and only when it is fired at theta is equal to 45 degree it will have maximum horizontal range because only then the sin 2 theta component it will have maximum value that is 1 okay so for this condition maximum horizontal range r max is 4 times the maximum height okay so this is the thing and we proved it here okay and also if you recall this uh, relationship between maximum height and uh, the horizontal range which is equal to 1 by 4 tan theta so maximum horizontal range is for theta is equal to how much 45 degree so for theta is equal to 45 degree tan 45 degree will be equal to 1 that implies h max by r max because r max why because theta is 45 degree that's why i have included r max that is equal to 1 that implies sorry uh, that that is equal to 1 by 4 into 1 because tan theta is tan 45 degree is equal to 1 that implies 4 r max is equal to 4 h max in this way also you can prove the same thing so either way you will get the same result here it is 1 by 4 into 1 because it is 1 by 4 tan theta tan 45 degree is 1 so here it is 1 by 4 into 1 so 1 by 4 h max by r max is equal to 1 by 4 that implies r max is equal to 4 h same thing same result either way they are all interrelated they have been derived from each other so either way any way you go either through this direct formula approach or individual formula you know this and you take the ratio and do whatever it is you will get the same result okay